let's talk about walking for fitness. Now, a couple of years ago, I actually had quite a bad injury. It's a neck injury and it's been quite serious and there's been a long recovery period. So my exercise has changed dramatically from what it used to be. I was quite an adventurous person where I was doing all kinds of sports that were maybe a little bit more injury um, prone things. And now I'm restricted but it's made me get a little bit more creative and it's made me start really enjoying some different things that I didn't used to do. Things like cross country skiing instead of snowboarding or just walking around my neighborhood instead of going for a run. And so today I want to share with you a little bit more about walking because walking is really good for us. It's something that I think we don't do enough of. It's something that's really good for our health and it's something that I think can bring us benefits in many different areas of our life. So for me, for example, I spend my day behind the computer and I can easily sit here for way too many hours straight without moving my body around enough. I don't need to go and put on gym clothes and have a gym membership and drive to the gym to get in a workout. I can just set a timer, remind myself and actually go for a really pretty walk. I can walk through, you know, the trails around my place. I can go down to the lake. Um, in the evening, I can take my puppy for a walk at, around the neighborhood and just have some quality time. When my husband gets home from work, sometimes he'll pull me away from the computer just to go for a walk with him and have that conversation that we're not both like busy or in front of the TV or one of us is on our phone or doing other things. Walking is a really good opportunity to have that quality time with your partner, with a friend, with your puppy, whatever that looks like for you. It's also an opportunity for you to just get your body moving in times when you maybe don't have enough time to have a full workout or go to the gym or, you know, do the sport that you love. And so I want you to take another peek at walking. Start thinking about where you can include more of it into your life. Start thinking about how you can get your body moving a little bit more than you already do. Now, walking doesn't necessarily give us the same health benefits as many other things, but it's still really good for us. And I think it's really, really lacking in many of our world. You know, if you tend to have drive everywhere, or if you tend to sit behind a desk all day like me, then there's definitely a lot more room in our life to get out for walks. So have a look at this week's blog. I think you're going to get a new perspective and and, and some thoughts on walking. And then let me know in the comments if you enjoy it, where you like to walk. Tell me a little bit about what your walking routine is or if you need to create a walking routine and let's support each other and motivate each other and come up with some ways to include this super healthy habit into our daily life. So go ahead, dive into the blog and please make sure you let me know in the comments what you think and how you are gonna approach this and your next steps. Okay, dive in and I look forward to hearing from you.